Spelly Joyce. My work focuses on disability as a creative source. Um, I have an impaired left hand from a car accident about 20 years ago, and it's really been a journey from um, denying my disability to really embracing it first and foremost in my practice. Specifically being very much trained and grounded within the tradition of classical music composition, um, but expanding outwards to more visual, physical, and social considerations, um, again, all in pursuit of disability as a creative source. I've been working on a kind of live performance iteration of the work titled Left and Right. Uh, it was developed in early 2021 as a video work um, and is actually, I believe, the fourth collaboration between myself and the dancer choreographer Jerron Herman. We both have impaired left sides, yet we always try to play with this kind of shared terrain, yet through different sources. And specifically in this work, I wanted to look more on the kind of mythical and biblical, all the stories of the left throughout history and even up to um, contemporary times. About a year ago, we were premiered virtually, and I was seeking out a live performance, but really didn't see it realistically happening. And until I got this Young Arts Fellowship, it really made it seem like much more of a reality. The fellowship has certainly been an invaluable opportunity, I think for me personally as an artist, but also more collaboratively. This has been such an invaluable opportunity to kind of take it to the next level, if you will, especially for a live performance. Um, specifically, that involves um, resources for developing a kind of workshop with that um, this week in Omaha, Nebraska, at the Bemis Center, um, and then eventually premiering it uh, live in person in Brooklyn and New York um, in June in National Sawdust. Um, fellowship has also been a valuable resource, specifically with um, working with the Young Arts staff and learning um, from them things, anything from documentation to reaching out to presenters. I really feel so, so grateful for their ongoing support and help and feel like I have this, was gifted this amazing team as like, again, these kind of resources and support that I'm, again, I'm continually grateful for.